we are trying to refer to the standard actions with respect to the standard controller. I am referring to the standard controller. When is a standard controller report? Sales force on every S object defined some of the standard action. What are those standard actions? Let us see. Events form. Events. Command button. Value equal to list. Action equal to what was this? List action on account object. List action on account object. Already Salesforce has defined this list action. Who has defined this action? On every S object, Salesforce has defined some standard actions. One of the standard action is what? List. Go for a preview. I got a list. When you click on this list, it is taking you to what? List view page. Every object will have what? List view page, right? All accounts, all open leads. When you click on this, we are getting this page. What is this page called? List view page. Like that, the sales force has taken you to what? When you click on this preview, sales force has taken you to what? When you click on the list, it is showing you list view page of the account. On the standard object, if you want to navigate to the list view page, if you want to show the list of account records in the list view page, then what is the action we have? List. What is the action that we have? List. Command button. Value equal to. Action equal to. We have view. Action equal to view. Let me give you, let me open any one of the record here. One of the account record I am opening. What is this? ID of the record. I am passing standard action. I loaded the page with this ID. Right? I clicked on view. When you click on view, whatever the ID we passed, the record will be opened in the detail page pocket. View the record in the detail format. View the record in the detail page. When I am giving, when I am giving this, go back again. Preview. When you click on the preview, I am opening this page. Right. I pass the ID. Whichever the record ID we passed, open the record in the detail page format. Open the record in the form of what? Detail page. View the detail page of the record. View is for what? To see the detail page of the record. I hope you are clear. Then. Let us go to the next one. Let us go to the next one. I am going for an echo. View. I saved the record. What did you get? I got ID. Command button value equal to action equal to I give a word for it. Whichever the record, whichever the record I am trying to give, I am giving an idea of the record. Whichever the record I am giving, when I click on edit, open this record in the edit form. Click on it, open the record in the edit form. Whichever the record I am giving, open that record in the edit form. If I give the ID, open that record in the detail page format. If I give the ID, open that record in the edit format. Similarly, I am giving delete. Whichever the record I am giving, whichever the ID of the record I am giving, whichever the ID of the record I am giving, delete that record. 
they click on the delete. Whichever the ID of the record I gave, delete the record. The panic get tested. Or the panic. So what are these? These are the sum of the stand action what Salesforce is providing. A list, view, edit, delete. Similarly, we have save, fix it. There are two more actions. What are they? Save and fix it. Are you getting my point? These are the sum of the standard actions which are defined by the sales force. I'll come back to save and fix it. So look at the buttons. What we have? List, view, cancel, save, fix save, edit, delete. Let me navigate. I'll make an example of this. I'm defining standard control equal to I'm defining an FX section then I'm giving it FX form page block Let's see the block buttons, location, here I was thinking, command button, value equal to, action equal to, Save, command button, value equal to, action equal to, command button, value equal to, Action equal to. These are the sum of the actions what I define. Save, fix save, cancel. When these are on the object called account, these are the actions defined with respect to this. Who defined those actions? Salesforce. Who defined those actions? Salesforce. Now I am trying to define. FX. Page block. Field value equal to account dot name value account dot list. Value equal to the code dot four. This is how we need. Let me open this. The code dot five industry. We have save, fix save, and cancel. I'm going to take the data. And if you call save, record is saved and open in the detail format. So, who has defined the reaction? Who has defined? Salesforce. We are referring to the properties defined on the SO object. We are not creating our own actions. Actions which are already defined by the sales force, those actions I am trying to reuse. If you want to refer to the actions that are defined by the sales force, then we will be using what? Standard control equal to name of the subject. 
I don't quit sale. Will don't quit sale. Sale the record. Come back to the same page. Where is it? Cancel. Go back to the previous structure. Are you getting my point here? Go back. I will preview. Go back to the home page. Are you clear? Cancel take away the home page. Are you clear about this format? So this is what? Actions that are defined. Save. Pick save. Cancel. Then we have seen. Edit. Delete. List. And we have view. List and view. I hope you are clear with this format. Clear for everyone. Clear? What are all these things called? Standard actions defined on every S object. Standard actions defined on every S object. Tell me the standard actions what we have. We have list, view, edit. Save, fix save, cancel. Save, fix save and cancel. Now, these are defined on every S object. These are defined on every S object. I hope you are clear. Right, boss? Okay. Any further queries on this? Yes. 